Okay, go ahead. Hi, I'm Buzz Stoddard with Cruising Yachts here in uh, beautiful Marina Del Rey. And I'd like to take this opportunity to introduce to you uh, what I think is probably the best deal on a uh, beautiful new cruising boat uh, here in uh, Marina Del Rey. This is a 2011 Juno 42 Dexalon, one of the most popular boats that uh, Juno has made. So this is the last of the 2011, and it had a wonderful run for a good number of years. Um, uh, two years ago, they modified the deck and uh, made it a little bit sleeker, so you have the more uh, the newest styling on this boat and uh, and the newest equipment, electric winches and so forth. So um, I'd like to give you a little tour of the boat, and um, it's it's being offered at a price that uh, you'll hardly believe. So. Welcome aboard and we'll have a look around. Welcome to the cockpit of the Juno 42 Dexalon. It's a magnificent cockpit. Uh, you couldn't find a better one for sailing, for entertaining, for lounging. Uh, it's awesome. It's a beautiful varnished table. Uh, folds out to a, a huge table for, uh, for dining and uh, enjoying the, the outdoors in our beautiful uh, Southern California weather here. Uh, the seats are large and straight. We have the two uh, uh, wells for helmsmen back here. Yeah, it keeps the uh, keeps away from the traffic flow, and um, uh, the the sheets have been led aft. And in this case, we have uh, the German sheeting, double-ended uh, main sheet. That's the red line, and um, with a separate winch. And then we have the primary electric uh, Harken winches, two-speed, uh, for the jib sheets. So it's very convenient for one person to handle uh, this particular boat, the way it's set up. The deck is very clean. Uh, most of the rigging is led under deck. Uh, this is an injection molded deck, so it's stronger and lighter than conventional decks. They don't have to go through uh, uh, cord hulls to lighten it up. They get all the lightning in the, in the deck by using the injection molded which is very expensive tooling, but the end product is far superior to, to anything out there. Uh, very, very few manufacturers can, can afford that tooling, but um, uh, Juno certainly can. And with the cabin top winches, everything is, is led to the cockpit so that, uh, again, it's very easy for a single person to handle it. Welcome below on the uh, new Juno 42 Dexalon. And you can get the effect that they're, they're getting by raising the salon. The deck salon actually takes the main salon that we're in here and raises it up, adds skite lights and large port lights, let in more light, and because you're up, even when you're sitting down, you can see out the, the port lights and um, get some view. We also have a very large dinette uh, across from a full settee. It's a wonderful setup for entertaining, just lounging, reading a book, what have you. And um, uh, these features have really made the salon, the deck salon, uh, some of the most popular sailboats in the world. Um, aft here we have the forward-facing nav station. The navigator is always like that. It keeps you oriented um, as you're navigating when you're facing forward. And we have a wonderful galley with the European style Corian. Um, a lot of lockers, huge reefer, beautiful polished stainless steel st stove, propane stove, nice fixtures this splash guard. It's just nicely detailed. Companionway steps are nicely shaped. They're curved so that as the boat heels, you've got a, a, a level place to place your feet. The forward cabin features a large hat, hatch, the port lights, a very large uh, centerline V-berth, quite comfortable, easy access, uh, nice hanging locker space. And of course, we also feature a uh, Private head with shower, very convenient. Welcome to the aft stateroom on the 42 deck salon. Huge king size centerline berth uh, with nice uh, seating on each side. Tons of locker space on both sides. Um, large hanging lockers and uh, so forth. So it's really designed for for cruising for extended periods of time and being very very comfortable so we have it's hard to see in the film but it pops up over the berth 
and there's a couple of port lights up above it. So um, it's a much less confining uh, stateroom than a lot of aft staterooms uh, with that design feature. Yeah, just go into it. As with the forward cabin, we have a private head for the for the aft cabin. It features a separate uh, stall shower and uh, very convenient. Uh, one of the features that boat owners seem to appreciate most about this design is that you've got two staterooms with private heads uh, at opposite ends of the boat. Everybody has privacy and your guests uh, 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 feel well catered to with, with uh, a very much of a yacht-like experience having their own um, suite with, uh, with a private head. So it's been popular uh, for those reasons and, um, and an exceptional value. Uh, right now for anybody who might be in the market for a new boat at uh, effectively a used boat price. <laughs>